Good morning, everybody. Down the gym. I've been down here uh, on a Sunday now for, what was it, two weeks? Three weeks, maybe? So straight on to the Stairmaster, climb some floors. We go for an Eiffel Tower climb today. Legs are feeling good after yesterday. So I'm out of bed, got straight up, got myself organised and sorted, and uh, yeah, feeling it a tiny bit in my knees, both knees equally, uh, which I guess is to be expected, but uh, not feeling it anywhere else. I mean, historically I felt it in the inner part of my leg, maybe uh, up near to the groin, in my ankles as well before, but after yesterday's run, not feeling anything like that, so very promising. Very promising indeed, but now time to put the work in the gym and uh, give it my all, just like I do with my runs. Just on the cross training now, and uh, actually what I thought I would do, I normally do rolling hills. Uh, today I'm going to go with interval training, so I've never tried this before. But I'll show you the screenshot in a minute, it appears to kind of level and spike and level and spike and level and spike. So I'm just going to enjoy it for what it is. I think it's important to change up the workout sometimes. Uh, obviously I don't want to change what's already working for me, but I know this does incorporate the hill element. Uh, so let's give it a go. That was a tough workout. Now I'm just doing a few um, arm bits and pieces before I go. Looks to be a pretty nice day outside, so hopefully I'll be able to get out and show you a couple of sights. We'll see how we go. Feeling good in the legs, so I should be able to get out there. It's a really nice day out here. I tried to go for a little jog, uh, legs aren't quite ready for that yet, so we'll do that tomorrow as more of a recovery run, but sometimes you don't know until you try, so I kept it very, very light and gentle and realised after about 30 seconds, no, 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 you need to wait, give it some time, don't be too keen, and that's absolutely fine. So, a couple of errands to run, then I'm going to take you up, hopefully, if I can get parked up there, just to a nice little spot at the top of my local town. We'll see how we get on. It was actually a spot that I recorded my first trail run at. Uh, it's a spot that I recorded a segment for a Forest Dean runner video. Uh, I've been up there a few times, but it, it's been a little while now just because it is trail based. So uh, I wouldn't really go up there when it was muddy and pouring or rain. Anyway, I'm gonna catch you soon when we're there. Just heading back up to the car. Walking through the castle grounds, don't know if you can see it, the castle just there behind the trees. It's a much, much busier day today in the castle gardens, which is always good to see. But that's the only issue. If you saw my video, the Alice in Wonderland video, which I'll put above, um, you'll notice that when I ran through, it was very, very quiet indeed. Not another soul in sight, but uh, my day like today, when the sun's shining, this is a pretty popular place to come and have some lunch. And uh, let's see, we've got a better shot of it now. There we go. There's the castle. So I'm going to walk through the castle gardens and up to the top. So I'm here. Beautiful location. Look at that view. Just taking it all in, really. As I say, this was uh, the place I first came for my trail run back in, oh, it was last summer now. And so I will pop that video up there for you to take a look at if you want to. It's just uh, one of those landscapes you never get tired of looking at, yet I don't come here often enough. And I don't really know why that is. There's no real excuse for it, to be honest with you, because once you're up here, um, there are multiple trails that just kind of keep, keep going into the distance. And uh, I'm pretty sure at some point it connects to... Um, the, the, the downs, the north downs, south downs, one of those downs, you can just keep running uh, all the way, all the way to um, probably some of the locations you've seen on other local YouTubers channels. I know that um, Ben Parks has done some work and uh, he's been up there. Uh, here we are running. I know some of the locations we featured on his videos. So it's just really, really nice. And I will get up here this summer some more, once the marathon's out of the way, I can do a little bit more exploring. Um, I thought about doing a trail run up here a few weeks ago, but I'm just a little tensive that uh, I'm the kind of person that you know, would get myself injured by being a bit of a, a bit of a fool and taking too many chances. So we'll wait until the marathon's over before I start experimenting some more with the trails. But uh, standing up here today, really standing, lots of dog walkers, guy walking around with his shirt off, <sighs> it takes all sorts. Uh, it's not summer, is it? But anyway, each their own.